Monday. As you can tell, I'm super freaking tired. Blake went to work with his dad, so it was just me and the squish. I had some breakfast and put some makeup on as Blake's mum was taking me out. I had to change Leo a billion times before we left because he kept pooing. And I tried to strategically feed him so that he didn't whinge in the car, but he kept falling asleep. So I had to feed him again while waiting out the front. I still can't drive after my C-section, so Blake's mum took me to run some errands. First, I went to check the P.O. box, stopped in at my work to get something, and then to Baby Kingdom to pick up my pram. Got home just in time to feed Leo again and then feed myself. Was exhausted after this, so laid down to have a quick nap, and while I was doing so, Blake got home just in time to wake me up to feed Leo again. Had a bit of relaxation, then got up to go to Blake's parents for dinner. Showed Blake the pram on the way out, which I built, of course. Headed to the in-laws house, got there just in time for Who Wants to Be a Millionaire, which I have been obsessed with lately. Leo got lots of snuggles. I got my favorite dinner and dessert. Then we headed home for what would turn out to be one of the hardest nights I've had so far as a new mum. Tuesday, this was definitely not a productive day after the horrible night we had. It mostly consisted of feeding, changing, trying to nap but being interrupted by a crying child, managing to find five minutes for lunch, more feeding, more changing, followed by dinner, watching TV and a very quick TikTok live. Wednesday after breakfast Blake and I took Leo to a hearing appointment at the hospital which was all good. I also managed to get him to see a midwife while we were there, got him weighed and asked some questions so feeling much better about all of that. It was my mum's birthday so she came over to spend the day with me and Leo and my friend joined us as well. I forgot to film so much stuff but I managed to get a couple loads of washing done and my friend stayed for dinner. We got pizza for Origin night but I accidentally fell asleep for most of the Origin game. Whoops! Thursday, once again, I was pretty useless at filming today. Breakfast and a cup of tea in bed with Leo. Managed to make the bed, put some washing away while Blake played games on his computer. Uploaded a YouTube video, then went to Blake's parents for lunch. We then headed to an appointment I had with the surgeon that performed my C-section. Relaxed in the afternoon, kind of got Leo smiling. Oh my God, I'm melting. And then had some friends come over in the evening. Friday, Blake went to his parents to help them with some renovations and my day started with an awkward stare from my dogs. Leo was quiet enough for me to have a shower, but then of course he wanted to eat when I wanted to eat. Thank God for a nursing pillow. He fell asleep for a couple of hours, which allowed me to make my bed, tidy my room and organize his room. More feeding while having lunch. Yes, I'm watching Kardashians. Don't judge me. I'm extremely bored. A couple friends came over for afternoon tea, some snuggles and chill time in the afternoon, followed by some dinner, TV and a visit from some friends in the evening. Saturday had another rough night with Leo so I was super dead this morning but determined not to waste the day too much. Managed to wash my hair before Leo became hungry again. My mum came over and made me breakfast followed by more feeding of course. Had some lunch and so did Leo. Sitting out the front in the sun when I got the urge to go for a walk. So exciting. Our first walk since birth. 20 minutes is all I could handle at the moment but it felt amazing. Little Squish was knackered so I managed to get some things done on the computer and put some washing away. Wasn't long before he woke up for a feed then we just relaxed in the afternoon followed by dinner and footy. Sunday started the day with some nice cuddles, got dressed and put some makeup on for the first time in what felt like forever, then had to feed Leo of course. Blake and I dropped Leo off at his parents place to spend some time with his family and give us the chance to go to lunch just the two of us. We went to the local shops and had yum cha which is one of my favourites, had to stop in at Kmart of course. We then spent the rest of the afternoon and dinner at his parents place and then home to relax and watch some TV. Thanks so much for watching. Make sure you follow our socials. Or you can just follow me because I'm better. Blake! What? Ugh.